we're going to quickly explain James Banks' five dimensions of multicultural education. The first dimension is content integration, in which teachers use examples and content from a variety of cultures and groups. In content integration, the unit or lesson is connected to other topics explored with students. There are multiple viewpoints reflected in the content. The materials and resources are reflective of the diverse identities and experiences of students, and the content affirms students as well as exposes them to experiences other than their own. The second dimension is knowledge construction. Teachers help students understand how knowledge is created and influenced by cultural assumptions, perspectives, and biases. In knowledge construction, the lesson or unit provides context to the history of privilege and oppression, addresses power and privilege relationships, helps students develop research and critical thinking skills, and creates windows and mirrors for students. The third dimension is prejudice reduction. Teachers implement lessons and activities to assert positive images of ethnic groups and improve intergroup relations. In prejudice reduction, the unit or lesson helps students question and unpack biases and stereotypes. It helps students examine, research, and question information and sources. The curriculum encourages discussion and understanding about the groups of people being represented, and the unit or lesson challenges dominant perspectives. The fourth dimension is equitable pedagogy. Teachers modify techniques and methods to facilitate the academic achievement of students from diverse backgrounds. In equitable pedagogy, the instruction has been modified to meet the needs of each student. Students feel respected and their cultural identities are valued. Additional supports have been provided for students to become successful and independent learners. And opportunities are provided for students to reflect on their learning and provide feedback. The fifth dimension is empowering school culture. This dimension uses the other four dimensions to create a safe and healthy educational environment for all. In empowering school culture, there are opportunities for students to connect with the community. The classroom is welcoming and supportive for all students. The teacher is aware of and sensitive to the needs of their students and their families. There are effective parent communication systems established and parents can talk to the teacher about issues as they come up in the classroom. So in closing, the five dimensions of multicultural education by James Banks are content integration, knowledge construction, prejudice reduction, equitable pedagogy, and empowering school culture.